Hi guys, um, except from the chicken there, but these are our uh, pumpkins. These are very so beautiful. We expect like at least like 20 pumpkins. Like from all I see, there's sproutlings. Yeah, those are just all pumpkins <laughs> ready to come. So yeah, that's just great. Um, we've got a lot. Now, when we first got them, they were like this big, <laughs> and now they're like bloody huge. We only have them for like a month or two. My dad likes to plant. My dad loves flowers. I love pussy vegetables, right? But this is his flowers. He's done a flower now. Um, yeah, that's where I buried. Um, if you didn't know, I'd bury. Um, my one died, and we put a new one called Rapunzel. And um, that's where we buried her. And I decided she liked quite a bit fast, so I planted some marigolds on her. That's my tomato one. Um, I have this greenhouse that I haven't used in a while, but yeah. And I've been growing these all other types of plants. This is great. Tessie, where are you going? Oh, oh. <gasps> trying to your She's going to find it. Look. She's like, I know it's here somewhere. Stay oh, away oh, from the wildflowers, Tessie. <laughs> You're such a little shit. Is that it? Yeah. No, she was trying to buy it as soon as I was getting up. You're such a you know, nasty little shit. Soon, Hetty, <laughs> soon. When it dies, okay? Don't give me a, a mean stare. Mwah. Yeah. It's so cute. I would have loved. She has this one white hair. I've been trying to give it to you. It's not amazing. No, it's a thing you go. You know what? <laughs> Do you like that one? Jack, Jack, Hetty's in my wildflower patch again. I know, I can see. Hetty. 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 No. Careful with, with the chickens. Careful, very gentle, yeah? Hello. Hetty. 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 Yeah. I said leave her then. Rapunzel. Rapunzel was quite nervous. She hadn't been outside before. I think they kept her in a, in a shed, but she's starting to enjoy it outside now so just to bring you up to speed uh, if this video is a bit over the place we got these eggs from uh, meal ridge farm fertilized they're shamos uh, you're gonna see sort of how they're coming on in the next bit after this but um yeah we got 12 eggs um they all seem fertilized you'll see how many we got left that are ready to hatch but uh, it's a good place to get your eggs if you're looking for fertilized eggs meal ridge farm Come in really decent packaging. Uh, yeah, I was really happy with the service. And hopefully in a few days time, we will uh, hatch some chicks. But uh, we'll have to see. We'll have to see, it's our first time doing it. So I decided to do it as a project with the kids. So I think this is like day four. And as you can see, some of the eggs are coming on really well. And getting nice bits of veins in there. And you can see they're starting to really grow. Um, there's another video in a sec uh, show you how they're really coming on we're on day 17 today you see, you see like and then there's many at the top like there's something in that you could tell and it's day 14 and it's like check out half the sack now so yeah we have thrown some away though and then some are just like weren't developed at all nah that one's not good yet nah being like that I don't know because
I don't know if it's just a really slow grower. I can't work out how to move. I don't know if it's just like really far behind or something. I'm going to keep yeah. it. This is also the one. That... This is the other dodgy one. Yeah. I think that, that one is dead. Yeah, that one hasn't grown since like day 10, Dad. <laughs> oh. Make sure you put them back on the bros. Yeah. That's... This one's good though. Look, look, look yeah. at that. Oh. See. See. And then there's Vinny Sally at the there's top. There's a chick, let's see. The air sat there. Yeah, that's where it will finally. I think on day six, tomorrow, yeah, this, the brain finally develops. Then day 18, or no, day 17, they start to turn around so they can, um, you know, start pipping at the bottom of it. So we bought this today. Um, we were just going to go with the light, we did buy a light originally when the chicks are hatched, but I was doing a lot of research reading online. Apparently this is a lot safer and uh, more affordable. It doesn't use much electric at all. It's just a heat plate that you can adjust to the right uh, to the right size that you want. So we're going to give it a go. It comes with a three year guarantee. And uh, over here, I've just set it up to have a feel. It's quite warm under there. Um, I think we're going to have to bring it down a little bit lower when we put it into the uh, into the pen for the chicks, but before I hope we should do a good job. <laughs> 